Macy's Elite to another rendition of Rosie's Random Treasures. I am back and today I am unboxing a lot that I got from the niche lady a couple of weeks ago. This ought to be great because I got some great ceramics coming up and um, it's like all rabbits and pretty stuff and fillies. Ooh. Easter and spring is coming up and that's kind of my you know, my thing with the family. Everybody's got their holiday to cook for. And mine, of course, is Easter. And, uh, I mean, my favorite holidays are at the end of the year. But, you know, Mama likes to hang on, old coin. So, um, I'm just going to jump right into it. You know, I'll talk to you as I go. We're just going to boop go left and if it's not your left on the phone then on the video then I'm sorry <laughs> okay so let's point you down towards the table you're gonna see my arms like you usually do and my lady did not disappoint with all the packing nuts uh, 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 uh. I only took out some of them because, you know, girlfriends and boyfriends, I got just so, you know, it gets old. <laughs> uh, where did I put my knife? It's over here. All right. All right, wait a minute. Let me put some more packing nuts in it. <laughs> I'm so done. That's what she said. All right, so as I clean these herb, just going to let you know that this captain over here, I got my shot, my first COVID shot yesterday, and it was absolutely 100% painless. I am telling you people, it, it, I mean, I don't even know what everybody's complaining about. They're making it look like the needle is so huge on the TV and scary and oh my god, what are we going to do? No. I didn't even feel nothing. I didn't even feel the plunger as the guy pushed down to put the medication in my arm. I didn't feel the needle. Nothing. Best shot I ever took. It, I mean, I get more from a... Uh, a flu shot than I do from this COVID shot. So, I mean, I'm not saying that my, my arm ain't sore, you know. That came on a little while after, but, you know, all these folks going, Oh, my God! No, not so much. And I am saving every bit of this that I can. Oh, dear Lord! I almost knocked over one of my drinks. That's not a good time. That's not a good time at all. All right. I'll do all that later. Whatever. First thing I got to open. Oh my gosh. This is a white. This is a milk glass. Um. Cabbage. Seriously. When have you ever seen a milk glass cabbage. I don't know about you. I collect milk glass, but I ain't never seen one. You ain't never seen That reminds me of Dumbo. No elephants fly. No, no. Alright, let's see, let's see. I like it. Can you guys see enough? I mean, you know, I'll point you down even further. See, folks? That is a darn cabbage. Oh my lord. There are no chips. There, it, I mean, you know this is something because it has clear areas um, that you can, I mean, almost see through. And that's not wear and tear. That's not paint. That's nothing. That is, you know, straight up like milk glass. I don't know if you can, yeah, see? Oh, there you go. Well, that's pretty cool. 
I stink, so that's why I got it. Now let's see. Where's my hand dandy magnifying glass? Where did I put it? Let's go! Oh no. Derek, it's right in front of me. That is why they gave it to me, right? So, darn blind. Okay. I don't see any writings inside here. No markings whatsoever. Sheesh. This is pretty cool looking people. Yeah, if I'm not careful with it, I'll bust it up, right? And I honestly, do, honest to God, I don't see any markings out here. But, I mean, that is pretty cool looking. You know, it could be something extremely expensive or it could be nothing but who cares that is definitely a conversation piece if i uh ever seen one and uh that's just the way it is i like it i'm gonna look it up figure out some more stuff but hey you know what happy saint patrick's day and f just for that look at that cabbage mm -hmm. See, it's fate. It's fate, fate, fate. Maybe it'll bring me some good luck. All right, back into the peanuts over here. Peanut gallery. Oh my God, it's everywhere. Get off my... I was going to say get off my package, but... Uh, gotta keep it clean. Gotta keep it clean. Oh, thank God that this thing is not metal. That's foreign language for metal. <laughs> well, that's New England for metal. <laughs> metal. Or should I say that's rosy for metal? Oh my gosh. Yay! I can't wait to see this. I remember. I can't wait to see these. Oh, they're so adorable. All right. We got our first one up. And I'll show you the front here. The cute little butterfly. Isn't that so adorable? Let's see. Stretch her out. Number 658. 62. Kaiser. West Germany. Hello. Something, something, something. Something. Something, something. I'll let you have a gander. You tell me what you see. See, there you go. Oh, let me. Sorry. I don't know how to do the whole herp. I don't know if you can tell now. All right. That's the first one. Ooh, that's the second one. And it's number 56 out of 658. Yeah, same company. That's real pretty, huh? That's nice. That's collectible, you know what I'm saying? These are collectibles. Yeah, and this one says 658 too, so I've got number 62 and number 56. Hmm, interesting. Hmm. All right, this one is number 56 as well. It's not the same? No. It's not the same, but, well, I guess that uh, I either am messing up my numbers or what? You got a little gold trim around it. It's nice. I can't wait to uh, look at these and uh, check them up on the internet. Look them up on the internet. You know, 62, 56, and 56. I mean, they're not the same, but they both say 
56 on them, so maybe, I don't, I don't know. This is number 62. Okay. And this is number 62, so maybe they all came out in like uh, little lines, you know. This is one set, maybe a set of four or something each time. You get a set, it's numbered out of 658, whatever they made, but that one's gorgeous. Look at how pretty with the little flowers. Ooh. Oh, they're so pretty. I love butterflies. And this one is another uh, number 62. This butterfly is sitting on the flower. So pretty. Again, with the gold trim. Everybody likes it. None of these little saucers or plates or, you know, I mean, uh, they could be, uh, shoot, uh, coasters. I don't know what you use them for, decorations. I'm not that cool. Uh are very different and very very much the same. I mean, oh wow, this one's gorgeous. This is number 76. We got a new number in the house. Oh, this one looks like it's looking back at you. Check that out, my friends. Check that out. With gold around the... They're very light. I mean... Look at my ba little baby hands. My hands are small. Small, small, small. And it sits in my little baby hand just like that. A little teacup, please. <laughs> so I got two, four, five. And I'm not sure how many came with the lot. Can't remember. It's been a couple weeks. So we keep diving and digging. Diving, 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 digging. So we got the... Uh, call it, um, oh my goodness cabbage and five little saucers or plates whatever we want to call them I will call them saucers Virginia ham served on saucers and if you're not into 1930s movies like I am, um, that was Jeanette McDonald and Nelson Nettie, Naughty Marietta. Look it up! They were very famous opera singers in the 1930s. And yeah, my mama just brought me up like in the uh, all kinds of culture. She didn't. Uh, you know, just keep me to one side. You know, I was very broad in taste. Oh, I know what these are. Okay. Oh, Peter was not very well during the evening. His mother put him to bed and made some chamomile tea. One yeah. tablespoonful to be taken at bedtime. Look at that. It's little Peter Rabbit. Oh, little buddy, he's sick. The little decorative plate. Let's see. Yep, yeah, Peter Rabbit. You can see it right there, Peter Rabbit. And what company? We've got Wedgwood, Frederick, Warren and Company, 1993, made in England. Sure, I can show you. Murder in England. That didn't do a darn thing, but I just want to be funny. I think I'm funny. Okay, let's keep her going. Oh, wow. Look at that one. Another decorative plate. This one is of the 
bunnies having a I don't know like a maybe a springtime bunny thing or maybe that bunny's getting married or something I'm not sure but it's really cute really really cute yep same thing and still having a hard time yo oh this is English fine bone china bunnykins 19 what 1988 Royal Dalton D-O-U-L-T-O-N Bunnykins Bunnykins is adorable oh my gosh alright uh, it looks like there's a little chip here but it's not it's just uh, tape from where an old uh, price tag used to be so G2G all right, looks like we got another bunny cans. This one, we got all the little bunnies at the schoolyard with some mice and the bunny teacher and the schoolhouse, and they're just having a grand old time at recess. You can see the cute little bunnies chasing each other on the ram. And uh, absolutely no damage here, people. I'm serious. I cannot wait to check the value on these and... Um, Put them up on eBay and see who's interested. English fine bone china bunny cans. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Registered trademark. Oh, this one doesn't have a date. Okay. But still made in England. Royal Dalton, England. Yeah. Made in England. England, England, England. Maybe it just has the, the 1988 on one plate. Who knows? Who knows? All right. Ooh, that's it. This one's another bunny kins, and it has same bunnies running around on the plate. And we have the painter bunny painting a his probably his wife and his child. And, you know, maybe it's the Bob Ross of bunnies. <laughs> It's so cute. These plates are adorable. They do not come with plate stands. They come as is. No plate mounts for the walls. Nothing. Um, but the plate themselves. So, when I put them up, y'all be the fast to know. Yeah, see, this one doesn't have the date either. So... I am gathering that is all that this is all one set. So I'm gonna have to look up to make sure that it only is a set of four because um oh wait, this one has a date. Let's see. It's uh well Royal Dalton Tableware LTD 1936, but I don't know. English Fine Bone China. I'm not sure if this was made in 1936 or if that's just like the date the company started or something. I'm not sure. I will get back to you. This one is a uh, bunny mama in the in the kitchen trying to feed them bunny chillings. Got the bunnies on the side running around. I'll bring her up close. She's cute. Trying to get the light out of the way there. All right, you got a good close up in the back again. No damage whatsoever. Wonderful. And when I'm done with the video, I am going to repack them the way they came in. So that way, when I sell them, they are not damaged and, um, I can just pretty much move them from one box to another. I mean, you know, that's just the way it is. Gotta wet my whistle. Let's see, anything else in this box? Nope. 
I'm just going to put those in there for now just to get them out of the way so nobody bangs them or nothing. Put those in right there. That on top of bunny pins all nice and nicey. And I'm going to think, I think I'm going to eat cauliflower out of there until I can wrap them back up. All right. Wrapping nuts, wrapping peanuts, whatever. This is box number two from, excuse me, I'm burping, uh, Mish Lady. So, let us see. Woo! Uh, it's funny because I am using a knife that I got in the aisle where you can get stuff for uh, um, sewing and, and whatnot. So it's not really a crazy knife and it's uh, plastic. I mean, I don't want to get caught up in that, but it's still plastic. And anyway, oh man, with these nuts. Oh, I just said it. Deets nuts. <laughs> All right, give me a second. I should have checked the box. I should have. These nuts. All right. Wee! That was much easier than the first one. Oh, okay. Yum, yum. I knew there was some cups or mugs or whatever in here. Stop! Give me such a headache. Yes, I think these go with the the bunnykins plates, maybe. Maybe. Or no, maybe the baby sauces. Who knows? I don't care. They are so cute. Oh my lord. Alright, this says 1936. Bunnykins. Yardy yardy. That is adorable. On one side, we got that dude playing the, is that a trumpet? I don't know. I'm sorry, folks. But then on this side, we got kiddos playing with, while the mamas are sewing and doing their thing. How adorable is that? No chips, no scratches, no paint removal, nothing. Thank you, Anishle Day. Alright, we got us another one. That's all that's gonna wrap bro Alright. Oh now we have the ladies at maybe brunch with the chillins on the floor playing with themselves in a moose. I mean a mice, a mouse. Oh my god. Alright, so we got that little bunny. And then we got these little bunnies. A bunny, a bunny, bunny. Must be funny. And then there is the stuff on the bottom. Like I said, no chips. No substitution, no stranges or refunds. That was a movie quote, cool, people. Why? God, that's so annoying. Why? Alright. Let's see. Let's see. So that schmutz can be wiped off, scratched off, whatevs. This one does not have a date on it. English fine bone, China, blah, blah, blah. There you go. 
And like I said, it's got some schmutz, but I was scratching it off with my fingernail. Burp, burp, burp. It's perfectly fine. Ah, okay. Then we got this scene we've got going on here. Pretty cute. I didn't get a good look at it, but it's still cute. Let's see. What in the world are they doing? You tell me. You tell me what they're doing. Is that mouse a nuisance or a pal? Adorable. So that's three cups. That's three cups. Three cups. I'm gonna make my own song. Cause I can't. All right. Oh, hey, yeah, we got the same scene as one of the plates going on over here. Look at that. Look at that. We had the same scene going on on one of the plates that we put a that I put away just now, and so. Those will match up. I'll take pictures of those and put them together, obviously, on eBay. But you'll get all my info at the uh, bottom of the screen when I'm done. There you go. No, two little bunny oneies. No damage. No damage. Uh, no damage. Making up words again. All right. Yep. 1988. They're in a, a box of their own, I guess. So, I will put that guy in there. And I will wrap as I finish. Not that kind of wrapping, fools. Nope. No, no, no. I am not back in middle school anymore. And my name is not Lil' Bear Road. Yeah. I used to want to be a rapper. Oh my god. Back in the day, but fate. Somebody take me out back. I'm done. Alright. So, in either case, that was my little cleanup from the niche lady a couple weeks ago. Two, two uh, boxes over here. We had the ceramics going on. The little... Uh, the four little plates that I showed you, and then the matching two cups, and, um, then we had those other plates, I think four of them, or five of them, I'll have to go again and look at them, and like I said, I'm not sure if they are sauces, or, um, coasters, or just decorative, but I like to know. So... Okay, uh, you got any questions what, oh, sorry, I forgot the cabbage again, and did I get anything other than that, I think I might have gotten something else as well, but my brain is poop, I mean, you know, the COVID shot, you get some crap going on here and there, but it's not too bad. Just, you know, some tiredness, a little fatigue, you know, you get fatigued. And, I mean, that's no different from a day-to-day -day because of my disorders and blah, 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 blah. I'm crying and whining again. I don't like to whine about that stuff, so. Because um, I have no reason to be any worse off than anybody else in the world because people have more problems than I do. So suck it up, look up. Um and I got time tonight. Anyway, so the fatigue sets in and your brain just goes up bleh. I liked it. I thought it was funny. Other than that if you got any questions whatsoever about my life, you know where to find me. You can email me at, and I'm going to put it in the description as well as the, the screen. They call me mama, 86 at yahoo.com. 
<laughs> on Sunday night, I got my video wrong, and I said the wrong email, but then typed the right, uh, the, the right spelling, so if you got a little fumbled up, I'm sorry. Maybe I'm sorry. Yeah, sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Stop saying sorry. Right. Anyway, um, T H E Y C A L L M E M O M M A 86 at yahoo.com. And my eBay is just they call me mama. Hold on. No 86 and no yahoo.com. T H E Y C A L L M E. M O M M A and uh I mean you know I've got a PayPal and I've got a Venmo and I'll give up that information um if you purchase and I've been doing so well that last night I purchased some stuff and I, I sold almost a whole lot that I got just one lot uh, <laughs> almost before I even sent in the, the payment from my end so seriously people I get what people want <laughs> if you're looking for something let me know and I'll I'll uh, see if I got it for you um, here listen to me going all braggadocious and crap I'm not trying to be all Crazy braggy waggy. Um, God, I'm just, you know, so good. <laughs> I'm just trying to take a sip of a drink before I turn you around and say goodbye because uh, I don't want to be all up in your face with my funky face looking face. Nope. All right. Show. I hope you had a wonderful time here on Cross Rally. Here on Rosie's Random Treasures. Mind me. I, uh. Oh, my poor boo boo. Mm, kissy, 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 kissy. I'm just kidding. You want to know how easy the shot was yesterday? Boom. It actually kind of hurt a little bit, but it was a great evening. I hope you had fun. My little video, thank God it was not an hour again. I'm trying to make these short, around a half an hour, under 45 minutes. I'm getting a little better, you know. How long has it been so far? Okay, 33.11, okay, 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 okay. Y'all probably like, dude, wrap it up. I already gave you all my uh, info, so let's see. Like, subscribe, hit the bell for all of your Rosie's Random Treasure needs. Um, share with your friends because I'm a hell of a good time. Oh, I just noticed that I was kind of sitting there like Gene Wilder from Willy Wonka. I was like, hmm, tell me how your day went. That's, that's effed up because, I don't know. <laughs> um, nothing else to say. So, please, share the word. I'm here. And where are your stories? I need your stories so I can start doing that in other, um, uh, what do you call it? In another folder or, uh, whatever. I want to start reading scary stories as well as doing my usual, you know, auction stuff, blah, blah, blah. I'm not, I can't do live auction yet because I don't got a thousand, but, um, running my videos, like doing this, I can't stop doing this i love this. this is my thing but um get on top of it i want to hear some spooky stories scary stories weird stories anything you got 
All right. I love you. I'll talk to you about later. And just remember, if you're not good and you're a troll, what does mama say? You're going to walk the plank. Just saying.